So we're setting up at the moment for the beer festival. Yep. You're looking yep. quite relaxed, so you don't worry anymore. Uh, it's, it's You know, everything's gone fabulously. The festival, every event's come off swimmingly. Great feedback from industry as well. So yeah, everything's gone great. So you better have good beer because locals drink good beer here. What are you serving today? We are serving our core four brands. We're serving a Golden Gates a Golden Ale, a Pesky Pig Pale Ale, a Open Road American Brown Ale, and a Homesteader Belgian Saison. Can you do that faster for me? I can do it so fast. All right, let's go. In my sleep. One, two, three. Golden Gates, Pesky Pig, Homesteader, Open Road. There you go. <laughs> You've done an awesome job so far promoting you guys. How does it feel? Fantastic. Amazing. Getting us out there. You guys have been one of the first ones to sort of get off the cap of the rank with the craft brewing scene. Yeah. Are you having fun with that? Oh yes, of course. Always having fun. Everything to do with beer is fun. <laughs> Bright orange, yeah, that's for you. That's a little smaller. Do you have a bigger one? So a cowboy ale means it's for a thirsty guy and a big guy. You think it's going to stack up? I do. Yeah? yeah. You want to give me a taste? Yeah, you bet. There you go. See, it's like out of my holster. It's a little tight, buddy. It's a little tight. How do you do organic with uh, with beer? Um, so all the ingredients um, in it are actually organic. So no, no pesticides or anything are sprayed on it. And the entire process, like even like the trucking, like it's different trucks than this is. Like everything, there's no cross contamination. You have me worried. So you're telling the rest of the beer the other guys makes no good? Yeah, don't drink that. Just drink these ones. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are going with this new can, Jobby. Can you yeah. see that, cowboy? You see? This new can. All their tall cans now have the 360 lid. This helps? It makes the beer taste better? Well, you actually get a little bit more of the nose. You can actually, uh, you know, the flavors come through a little bit nicer. You can smell uh, the Pilsner there. You don't do a lager? We, we have a Pilsner. I uh, no, no, no. The yeah. lager is usually a hard beer, so I just yeah. want to see if you guys have sort of worked your way to the to the lager yet. No? I'll show you, I'll show you what we do have. Okay. We're, we're just putting holes. Do a Kolsch? You do a Kolsch? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's not a lager though. Well, it's a golden ale, but we, we ferment it a little bit cooler, which kind of brings out more of the characteristics of a lager. Pilsner? There you go. To be quite honest with you, Pilsner's the hardest style of beer to brew and to keep consistent. So even in my tenure with Steam Whistle, I've seen massive improvements, and it's the most consistent beer that we've ever produced. When are you growing up for the lagers and the Pilsners? So we do have a Pilsner. We just didn't bring it. Uh, we have a blueberry wheat ale that's light as well, another 4% beer. How's it going so far? It's, we love it. It's been such a fun thing. It's a family-owned and operated brewery, so it's myself and my mother here today, and then there's my brothers and sisters as well that are involved in it, so it's That's been a pretty mom? fun. That's my mom, yeah. It's good Mother's Day, early Mother's Day for us to hang out here today. I thought it was your sister. I, we get that a lot, actually. We get that a lot. Whose idea is that? Mine. You're the, you're the designer? Yeah. You're the brewer as well? Yeah. You're the owner as well? Yeah. That's the way we like it, eh? Yeah. How's it going, big guy? Not too bad. How you doing today? Hey, I'm trying to grow my beer. It's not working. You got to eat more bacon. Is Disney going to give you some assholes or whatever one, do you think? Last time I checked, Disney was in the business of selling entertainment to families, not selling beer, right? And Joe was a security detail, and he was the, the biggest asshole they ever met, so they nicknamed him People Skills. And the legend lives on on the beer can, so that's where so Man, people's you, skills come You guys from. have got guts. <laughs> you know, you, you choose an asshole, then you make a beer about it. Yeah. Please don't get bored out. Don't sell out, all right? This time around, even if you have to, you know, bend the rules a little, stick around, please. We're having fun, man. We, well, we're not going anywhere. We just, we just started. Good. Uh, just started. By the way, we're going to be in your neck of the woods in June, so Hold we're coming it. to say hello. Hold on. Really? So yeah. whoever is in charge there, warn them. Two cowboys is on their way. Wait, what? Two cowboys is on their way. Even better. Yeah? Just give us a heads up, and we'll welcome you with uh, open arms.